Many people may get confused when they try to tie the karate belt. I'd like to show you the two different ways. The first one is you find the midpoint of the belt and bring the midpoint to the stomach, front part of the stomach, and wrap it round the waist. And take the top part of the belt and put it through from under. Make sure that you put it through both belt, not just one belt. And pull it up. And once you come to this point, try not to tie the belt by moving both ends. That's how many people get confused. All you need to do is to take the top part and bring it down. And you still keep it on top of the other side of the belt. Then from this point, you take the bottom part up over, over the top belt. And put it through the loop and pull it. Now you will see a crossing at the back, but this is the correct way. The second way is to tie the belt without creating the crossing at the back. Now this time you need to know the length of your belt and take the one end of the belt and put it on the hip, doesn't matter which side of the hip, and wrap it round. And wrap it on top of the other end once, and wrap it round one more time. and put it through from under. Then from this point, you take the other end, pull it down. And at this point, if the length of both sides are not equal, you can, you can adjust. Then pull the top part, still keeping the top part on top of the other one. And just move the bottom part over the other side and pull it. In this way, you can remove a crossing at the back. There is still a crossing, but crossing comes to the front, just behind the knot. 